In some mountainous village in China's western areas, zip lines are the quickest links to civilization. But villagers take no safety precautions when zip lining, not even wearing a life jacket when going over water. It is especially dangerous at night. Earlier this month, Premier Li Keqiang pledged to replace all zip lines with bridges this year in his government work report. According to the national plan, from 2013 to 2015, about 290 bridges will be built in seven western provinces, half of them in Yunnan province. Nujiang Prefecture in Yunnan province has three vast rivers. To meet the premier's deadline, local authorities have nine months to finish 17 bridges. Three years ago, the provincial government built a bridge across Nujiang's deep ravine, making trips to town easier. The elderly were often too scared to zip line. The new bridge brought them fuller and more liberated lives. It also eased the transportation of construction materials, resulting in about a third of families in the area building new homes. In China's long-term poverty alleviation campaign, transportation infrastructure was identified as a crucial aspect. Premier Li Keqiang also said in his report that the rural poor population is planned to be reduced by 10 million this year, with 200,000 kilometers of rural roads built or upgraded.